I'm going to tell you directly with no if, buts, or 98% or 99%. It will be 100. In that moment, you don't need to pray. Even if you pray, you can't change what I will say. One of them is a Muslim. One of them is a Christian. So by any means necessary, my direction is a Christian. But this is not a Christianity in that sense. What if a Muslim will be able to do more for God than a Christian? Imprim Penya de Menka Ghana Seb. Then so Minyako Mountains and Amebadia and Ameka Ghana Asem. Sabreno, Mefre a ye parties me noa e dia kutene awa Ghana, Mitre N P P A Doctor Baumia and a duo monim and N D C A Yura John Domani Mahama and so so and a duo monim. Mefro munina and no munina edin commona de or be convince meno or no and a meshan com de amano. Miss Chan comes so me cassia as me sin a bidin kunimwa. Mwa kasi mwa nitu ya se mfibi bribe yini. Anu masha sa anko mwono. Ama ni nina asusu ebe mwu. He. Me. Me tu mwa kasi bia anu pa mini di. E wia. Mini di. Anu mre mini di. Nye se mini di se bia. Kwa mwa ni mina mini di. Ubiya bi binti. Na me nya kwenye anu kwa anu didi. Na ebi a mwem. Na me nkwa msha edia. Me sha. O kwa suru pa fom. He. Ki ane ki. Ebe be mwu. Na me mwum diye. Me nshe. Se mi ye kristo ni, yinti me kwa shen kom edi ama kristo ni. He, a kristo fo bi bribi, ya shen kom di ma womo, ne mo mo shen bwa ha, omo ni so. En so kremo fo diye, ana kremo ni diye, wa shen bwa ha o di so. Yinti min kwa kase bia mi ye kristo ni inti, me kwa shen kom di ama kristo ni, ama kristo ni edi nko ni. Na di me ti mi akani se, se mi nyako ma anto nsine ba, na mi nyambe shen men komo yu ya, he, o bie ni ho be tu mi asisa no. Ni pada se ni bere ni hobe tu ma se sano. Tu mi bere ni hobe tu ma se sano. Oba ye den. He opa tu ko vim. Tu fa fom. Fem fim fim. O bere ni hobe tu mi asisa no. We yi aya prophet enje ubet. Aha yi wa brimful radio. Yen kuti en emra. There are some here. I've mentioned about Ghana. And. Within the morning. Before. I. Have to be with my father, Pastor Chris. What I'm trying to say is, I'll go to the Mount Moriah, to that Fort Moriah place, and we'll get there, and I will talk to God about Ghana. So hear me well. So that when I come from there, I'm going to tell you directly with no if, but or 98% or 99%. It will be 100. In that moment, you don't need to pray. Even if you pray, you can't change what I will say. I will tell you who is going to be the president without ifs or buts or this or that. You can cut what you like out of context. It doesn't fly. I'm beyond that level of stupidity. I've been doing this for years. I'll tell you and even say again, this one I'll say 300 million percent. And it will be exactly the same way I say it. It will never change. You Listen, I can miss lunch, I can miss breakfast, I can miss dinner, I can't miss prophecy. You wait until you die. This man here will not miss prophecy. No, it's never going to happen. Wait, right, what? Breathe fire if you like. See, I'm saying from now on, listen to what I will say about Ghana. Now, from now on. Why am I saying from now on? Because tonight, I have to talk to the two candidates. This one on this side, and this one who is the vice president of the country. I have to talk to them. And when I talk to them, I'll hear what they say. You say, you say how? I'll call them. I have the direct numbers. I'll call them today and hear what this one is saying. Hear what this one is saying. And then come here and say, I'm now convinced this one stands for God more than this one. One of them is a Muslim. One of them is a Christian. So by any means necessary, my direction is a Christian. But this is not a Christianity in that sense. What if a Muslim will be able to do more for God than a Christian? Not talking about Ghana now. I'm coming back here. Not talking about Ghana. What did I say? Not talking about, repeat this. Not talking about Ghana now. 
Most Christians, when they promise you they are going to do this, they won't do it. You put Christians in power, they don't make up for what was lost when they were not in power. They will not respect Christianity. Look at what we did with Obama. Waste of time. That was the beginning of the fall of America under Obama. But guess why, why we did it? Skin. And this is why I don't like this thing of calling mixed race people black. Who told you this? 23 chromosomes, 23 chromosomes. Why, why is this one black? Obama was white. I don't believe in that nonsense. I will be able to tell you here, pa, 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 you go with what you like. Was it not last week? I stayed today, I said, when you see him, when you, he wins, you will start saying. And people didn't even know what was I saying. What date is it? 10 November. This is the day I'm saying, measure what I say from now. We'll give you a backdrop, a background, um, when the prophet comes. We'll give you a backdrop of all we said, but that's neither here nor there. Because I needed him to call in 10 days. We then got a call after a few days, after days, days after, in fact, weeks after. And there were discussions there, there were con conversations there on what God will do through him. But you see, what about him who is a Muslim? Why are we just ignoring the Muslim guy? Because he's a Muslim? No. Let's hear what he is doing for Christians. If a Muslim is going to come here and give freedom to the church, and a Christian comes here and binds the church, I'll go with the Muslim. As much as every human being lies, but there is a certain integrity Muslims have. That if they give you their deal, you are doing a deal. I'm telling you this. I've been in business for too long to know my Christian brothers. You tell them this tomorrow, they can shift. I said, I didn't mean, no, 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 no. You did not hear what I was saying. Is it what is in the Bible? No. So that's not to say the Bible is false. This is where the problem is. You know? You lose people like Andrew Tate. As a religion, I know you don't. So he doesn't matter. He matters. He's a voice that is sharp. A voice that is poignant, important, potent, loaded. You lost him to Muslims. Why? Because you're too stuck up. So did science. You weak. You are sissified. What is in the Bible is not seen in your works. So the people that were following Christ are thinking this is the example of Christianity. And they step out of their religion. They love Christ, but they don't love the Christian. Look at Mahatma Gandhi. He said, I love the Christ, but I hate the Christians, for they are unlike their Christ. A man who was in Hinduism wanted to be a Christian. Looked at the works of Christ and says, this is what I like. Then looks at the Christians and says, uh, 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 I'm not going to be this. This is the problem with you. Christians... I have a problem. In Christianity, hear this, Christ forgives. Christians don't. One fault a man of God makes, oy, every day they'll be talking about it. Liar, robber. Every day, every minute, they won't stop. What if he asks for forgiveness and is now safe in the hands of your Christ? He should stop preaching. Who are you? 